This is the print head read and write. In this video, we are going to show you how to use this tool to write the pre-stored data into your print head. In the package, you will find this tool and then the cable. Just plug this cable into your computer USB and then the other side into the device to get it powered. Once it's power on, the default option here is option 1, which is used to read any data from the existing print head. And once you have read the data, and the device will get the data, and then you press the red button. Here comes to option 2 which you can save your data that just read out save it to L I'm not quite sure what L means here maybe it's left this device can allow you to save two sets of data so you can either save it to left or press the button again which means you can save it to right so there's left and write two sets of data you can save. In this video, I'm just on going to show you how to write your data into your print head, which means you are going to reset the print head to your saved data. So you just press the button again. Here you comes to option 4, write data stored at left position to print head. Once you come to option 4 and then just put your print head that you want to reset gently into this gap, into the position here and since I'm using one hand to hold my video, uh, then usually you just use one hand to press down the print head, and then use the other hand to press the green button here. And then you'll, you will see this menu here changed to OK, and then you press OK to confirm. Now it's done. As simple as that, then this print head now has been reset to the data that has been saved in this device. Say if you have uh, a print head, uh, say this very old version, IH035, and you would like to use a newer print head, say PF03, then what you should do is use this print head read and write tool to read the data out of this PF03 print head and save to this device and put your print head on and then use option 4 or 5 to overwrite it that's option 5 to be simple once you get this device on, and if it is already with a set of data that's been saved into the device, you can just simply go to option 4 and put the print head on, press the green button once and twice to confirm. Then it's done. 